I think I'm constantly doing work, just constantly trying to figure out Josie. That's what's really nice about working on a series is I actually have a diary for Josie oddly enough. Really? Yeah, and so every episode, Josie as a character, there's a lot that she really doesn't say to a lot of people. She's kind of the, she's constantly putting other people's problems ahead of her own just to make sure that everybody else is happy. So there's a lot of things that she just doesn't say. And so every episode, I'll actually write a letter to whoever it is that's kind of causing her the most problems in that episode, just kind of explaining and figuring out how Josie feels. And I also have like a music playlist that I listen to for her and just different things like that. All right, now we're going to get into it. What's on the music playlists? A lot of just love songs of just oh, really? heartbreak Aww. and sadness. It's a very sad playlist for some reason. I don't think she's a very sad person, but she's just like a very, she feels very deeply for a lot of things. And so it felt right. That's, I love the idea of writing a letter in character and, and sort of like getting into the headspace in that way before. Is that something new for you as an actor and like doing that exercise of sort of writing something out and living in there for a little bit? Absolutely. I used to only do diary entries and that's how it started for her. But then when I realized that there was so much that I wanted to say to so many people, it started out one time just being like, oh, this is what I would say to my dad if I would get the gusto to talk to him about this. And then it turned into, oh, I think this is kind of healthy as me, Kaylee, playing Josie and just to get into Josie's mindset. And that's, it kind of spiraled from there. <laughs> 